Hey guys, today we'll be looking at the Trackmaster Go Push Along Gordon. Here's the front of the box, here's the back, and I noticed, you know, it has created by Brit Craft and that stuff on there, based on my series. So, yeah, that's a nice thing to know. And, so, I will be looking at this today. Ah, let's open it. I have a lot in it. <laughs> this will be a job. Ah, there we go. There's the... There's the engine. I'm just going. Alright, let's just clear away all the trash. And here is Gordon. I must say, really nice. Really like those, like the fact that it says real metal on it. Hmm. Right, so here's his tender. No buffers on the back for some reason. But there's buffers on the front where there shouldn't be buffers. And here is Gordon. Yep, there's white on his and his eyes probably reflecting something. I've noticed on the top that his lining is slightly off on his one sec. It's slightly off. Like ever so slightly. Well, really good. He's got his name on his bottom. And he's made in Thailand. And he's riveted. And you know, he's got this. Right, so really good. Let's go compare him to some of my other Thomas merch. Let's go compare him to some of my other Thomas merch. Here's Gordon. Here's Edward. Here's a 20. Here's 2009 Take and Play Edward for scale. Hmm. Gordon, he's not really actually that much bigger. You know. Here's an overview. Buffer Buffer beam to buffer beam for the most part. Hey Gordon is longer though. It's tender. But Edward, he's around the same size as Gordon. And the tenders are nearly identical. Gordon seemed a bit more squished out. Edward actually has different sizes of wheels while Gordon the exact same wheels. Here's right. So here's him with his brother, the flying Scotsman, Trackmaster One. And here's the 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 Gordon I was using before, the My Busy Book version, which is really an upgrade because this thing is like twice the height of my My Busy Book one. So, Really an upgrade. Let, let's get him to the flying Scotsman. Because he's thinking, this is Trackmaster push along. I just gotta get it in there. Double handed now. Oh, there we go. Nice good connection. Uh, let's see. I'm gonna get him some wooden railway tracks, see how he handles. Here I've put some wooden railway tracks. And these things, you know, same gauge as Trackmaster, so. Alright, so he fits. He fits really well. Like nothing's scrub. On him, you know, nothing's scrubbing on this, rubbing on this underside. Let's see how he takes to mid tight course. Oh, really well, to be honest. 
This man will be able to something like that well though. Okay, go on in here. Okay, so you can see much good success on this. Oh, yeah, that was right there. Oh, let's get him some... Okay, so I got a turntable as well. It's a really small one. Didn't earn it for really work on this. Now let's put them on. Nope. Same case. Bad, really. Dude, let me let me get up some track master stuff. Trucks to pull. Alright, so I only have one track to my track master thing to reveal if that works. I got a mega box, so that'll be standing. stand in. And here's Gordon, so let's hook him up. I'm hooked up, and you know it's right height level. Right level and stuff. That'll work. I'm gonna get it uncoupled. I'm really happy with this Gordon, and you know, this is a really good step up from what I originally have, and yeah. This feels good. We are soon getting Henry. We're looking for him now in these. We're looking for him now. So, bye guys. Bye.